Hi, I'm Kevin Eikenberry, and I'm here to help you reach your potential as a leader and a human being. Welcome to Remarkable TV. Today, we're talking about birthdays. Are you ready? Let's get started. So why was I wearing that silly hat? Well, I promised you we were going to talk about birthdays, so why not? wear a hat. So here's what I know. Everybody has birthdays. And what I also know is that many people love them. Now, I guess how much you love them may depend a little bit on how old you are. But you know what? Most people really do appreciate that special day. And so one of the things that we can do more effectively as leaders is to appreciate and find ways to recognize our team members. And I believe that a birthday is a really good day to do that. I'm reminded of one of my clients who in an organization with over 200 employees is has a conscious process of sending everyone a birthday card and he hand writes birthday cards and sends them to people's homes on their birthdays and he shared that with me one day and then I asked him about why he did it and what were the responses that he got well the one the first thing was that he said I did it because the organization was too large for me to have the kind of relationship that I wanted to have with everyone, but I wanted to do whatever I could to recognize and try to build relationships with people, and I felt like birthdays would be a great way to do that. And the second question he's, I asked, so, so uh, what have you found? Give me some stories about what's happened. He goes, Kevin, it's unbelievable. People will come up to me on a different shift. People will come up to me whenever they see me, and maybe it's weeks or months later, and thank me for the card, talking about how they're – they, I was the only, it was the only card they got or that their uh, spouses said how amazing it was to get a card from, in many cases, their bosses, bosses, boss. Listen, as leaders, recognition and appreciation is important. And while there's lots of times to do it and lots of reasons to do it, why not pick a golden day, someone's birthday, as just one way to let them know you're thinking about them and that they're special. And all of that leads us to today's Tweet. Find ways to celebrate people you lead. Their birthday is a good place to start. Now, I'm not as good at this as I'd like to be, but I'm working on processes to get better. And this doesn't have to stop with just employees. Certainly don't forget the people in your family. And what about vendors? What about customers? Anyone who's important, a birthday is a great time and a great chance to take advantage of that. Now, I know you're not my employee, but I want to practice what I'm preaching. So here's the deal. On this page is a place for you to fill out a form. And if you'll fill out that form and let us know when your birthday is, and you do not have to give us the year, but if you'll tell us your birthday, I promise you that you'll get a birthday wish from me every year. And I promise you might even get a gift. But most of all, it'll be one way that we can show you that we appreciate who you are and what you do in the world. It's our pleasure to do it. And I look forward to wishing you a happy birthday.